die pirate. It's everybody's favorite Uncle Uncle Buddy, also known as the Sky Pirate. And I would love to welcome each and every one of you to my channel. And guess what? I'm going to announce the giveaway. I know I did it Saturday at our fundraiser for the Hendrixes, but I'm going to do it again tonight, which the winner is Jody Pachonik of our Kansas City. Jody, you can get your card and your quarters whenever you want. Just let me know. Give me a holler. I can bring them by. Um, or you can come and get them or whatever. Anyway, you won. I'd like to thank everybody that came out to help the Hendrixes and help me and my wife raise some money to help take care of some medical bills and everything. And we had a pretty good turnout, had a pretty great fundraiser. Everybody that helped, I cannot name you all by name because I'm going to forget someone and I don't want to offend anybody. But there is a lot of family and friends, a lot of them, that put in a lot of hard work. So anyway, thank you everybody. It's been great. Jody, come get your stuff. Also, I got some video. Me and Shelly went over to Pitcher, Oklahoma on Friday and... We just took a little road trip. It is raining, and I had about a 15-minute window once we got there to get any video that was worth a darn at all. I got some handheld video. That didn't turn out very good, but I threw some in there so you can look at it. Um, but the drone video is pretty fly, pretty fly. So I hope you all enjoy it. I usually have jokes to tell, but I don't have no jokes today because I only got dirty ones going through my mind and I know how the more sensitive types out there in Facebook land, well, they get their little panties in a wad when you tell a dirty joke on one of them public pages. So, I don't know what to do. Don't know what to tell you. Just enjoy this video. It's a wonderful video. You're going to like it. And remember, go to my page. Go to my YouTube channel. Subscribe, hit the notification bell so you know every time I have a giveaway or a video comes out. And just enjoy, enjoy my page. Send me content. You have any requests, you want me to go out and do anything, just let me know. Get your friends, get your family, get everyone you know to subscribe to what? Hello, mate. We're going to subscribe to the Sky Pirate. Yes, we are. <laughs> That's how this guy talks. Sky Pirate, here we come. Oh, we are going to the Sky Pirate channel to watch some video. All right, come on down, hit the Sky Pirate video, and let's get this stuff done. Uncle Buddy loves you once and for all. You're my favorite, each and every one of you. Bye. Mwah. See you all later. Have a good day. Bye-bye now. All right, well, here I'm going to do a little bit of narration for you all to start out with. I got a little bit, there's a picture of Water Tower, which says on it when the town was, was incorporated. And we'll just fly by there a little bit. So we're going to switch over. Just over here, I guess you could say it's to the east of the Water Tower. It looks like it might have once been Native American housing. Pretty modern housing to be completely abandoned, that's it right there. The building that you see with the cart, well, we'll see it here in a minute. I had to get a picture of the, of the cell tower or whatever it is, just because, you know, it, it was a structure. It looked cool. But anyway, you see where the cars are right there? That actually is the police department. And with... Um, that part of the police department and a few of those houses around there they still are lived in and the police work out of there now all of those other houses that you see though there's no glass no doors no nothing there's keep out signs all over them but there wasn't those that said you couldn't fly over them so you know that's what I did but anyway 
We'll stop here for a little bit and let you look around, fly around, whatever. I'll be back with you here in a minute. Enjoy the music. Yeah, and there's some more of the abandoned houses. I mean, they're modern. They're nice places, but you just can't live there or your kids are going to grow three legs and things like that. That lead is horrible. And as you can see, kind of in the back, way back down there, those are part of the chat piles. I don't know, there's half a dozen or so. And that chat is just ground up stone and rock where they get the lead and the zinc where they pulled it from. And the powders there, the big chunks isn't so bad. It's the powdery stuff that, that'll get you. And we'll fly through here a little bit more just, just for the heck of it. There, go by the police station. Look, that last police car you see there, that one there, they ran into a pole with it. Maybe here in a little bit, we'll get a little bit better picture of it. But here we are just flying around the housing, looking at what we can look at. Do-da, do-da, I wanna see some picture houses. Do-da, do-da. All right, and then here, oh, here we go. We're gonna be looking at flying into, there's also a tornado came through and tore up a lot of these houses and buildings. And this building here that I'm showing you, there's no roof or front to it or anything. It's just a ruins. I mean, it's a modern day ruin. And I don't know what kind of store it was. It looked like there maybe was a couple of them there. But yeah, a tornado tore that up and, and just horrible. And then right behind it, I'll show you there's some residential place back there as we get over to it that it got tore up too right through there it's still standing but I mean it's just blown apart it's abandoned and it's modern it's laying there it looks pretty but no it's dead there ain't nothing there you don't want to live there I'll tell you what I didn't even see mice running around that place so who knows what the heck's gonna happen but yep that's it. All right, give her a little bit, minute here, and we'll whip over and take a look at what's next. Dooby 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 doo, da dooby dooby doo, ba dooby doo. All right, now here's a couple of the chat piles. I didn't want to get too close to them, but I flew over them, and I mean they're just basically big piles of sand. And back in the day, kids used to go up on top of those and slide down them like if they were on sleds, you know, in snow. It's just horrible what they've done. I mean, it's, it's destroyed that environment. That's unusable land. It was a nice town at one time. But, you know, you got little kids with crab crawls, crab claws running around. That's scary. Six-headed kids. Mama's, you know, being having quadruplets but only two of them coming out but they're all joined together at the butthole this is sad 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 what what could happen in a situation like this but this ladies and gentlemen is picture oklahoma and this is just an old trailer house it mostly blown apart but it's falling apart and there's little pieces of this and that and that and this and We'll see what we got and we'll see what we miss. But anyway, this is what we got. Picture, picture. Let's take your picture and picture. I mean, this thing, it looked like it's blown apart and things, people's been through it and everything else. But I mean, it's just, they left their stuff. There's that, this house looked like it was completely still furnished and everything. There's a toilet laying there. Somebody probably just kicked it over. But back in there, you can't see in it. And I tried to get a little bit closer, but there was a couch just sitting there like it was always supposed to be there. And then all them buckets around and, you know. Anyway, that's the end. Y'all take it easy. Uncle Buddy loves you. Bye.